Hey, what's up YouTube? Fearblaze here, bringing you guys another episode of the Shell SMP. So today we're at my house, and there are a bunch of things I want to talk about. So, first of all guys, it is June 1st, and it is 11.48 at night. In 12 minutes from now, it will be midnight, and I have school tomorrow, so... Yes, I decided to record Shell, because SG wasn't going too well. So I apologize for those of you who were expecting some, uh, Shell. Wish you had Spruce Wood. Same. <laughs> So, we're just gonna patrol the server, put some stuff away, and I want to talk to you guys about something important. So, the only reason I'm recording my chest putting away is because I have important things to talk about with you guys. I'm gonna lower the volume for this, because that may be annoying. Um, first thing is, by the way, I have a bunch of enchanted books, Bru boom that we've been doing off-camera, and here are all of our saddles. We've been trading with Slaps' as villagers, trying to get them to breed for him, so that's nice. We now have 41 ore, that's pretty good. But, um, that's not what this video is about. <laughs> I mainly recorded this because I want to talk about just a bunch of topics I had to in mind. So the first one is, is June 1st, and I get out of school in 14 more school days, and I was curious, when do you guys get out of school? Do you guys have, like, a countdown of how long until, oh, wow, there's no room in there. I guess we'll put this in our valuables chest, I guess, because we need, do need to make a farm. That's one thing we definitely do need to make, but... When do you guys get out of school? I get out June 19th, and I'm just really curious because a lot of people get out at different times. For example, Skips and Slaps are already out of school, but like me and everybody else in the shell, we still have school. So, kind of sucks, but whatever. So, we're going to head over to spawn, by the way, guys, after I show you guys something downstairs. So, we do need to do our bedroom, by the way, still. If you guys have any suggestions, just let me know down below, and yeah, we'll get started. But over here, we do still have the cow and then the chickens down there. Over here, we still have our melons. There should be a lot stacked up. Yeah, they're stacking up now. Oh, yeah. There we go. Nice. So, you know, we have a bunch that we can do, whatever. Down here, we still have this contraption here. We still need bones. We don't have a skelly spawner. I did find a zombie spawner back in the ravine, and there is a um, spider spawner right there. So, but no skelly. And what I did was I kind of built a path around here because I realized I'm running low on food. And I'm going to make this a big room and make it a giant farm room where I just have... Wheat and everything just everywhere. So yeah, like wheat will be there and then I'll just like fill up this room and it'll, I'll make it automatic eventually. I just needed some because I need wheat to feed my cows to make them reproduce because that's the only way I'm going to get food. And eventually I'll make a potato farm down there too. Oh yeah, my armor. I did enchant a bunch of boots. I got fire protection three, feather falling four on these. I traded chain helmet with Slaps' his villager. One of them sells full chain armor, if you guys didn't realize from one of my chests over here. So I snagged a quick group of that. I thought someone... Yeah, someone killed Shadow, guys, so we have to get this. I guess we'll name this cow horse. Wait. Wow! <laughs> I guess we'll name this horse cow or something. But, see, as you guys see in here, I did also trade one of Slaps' villagers for a Protection 2 diamond chest plate. We have the full chain there. We traded for three chain helmets, because why not? And... We fished out both of these bows, which is really shocking. And I do have a fishing stuff chest over here. Boom. And I ate all the other fish because hungry. But we're going to go back to spawn now, guys, and see what's going on. I think Skips is building a shop. I don't know if he's done with it or what's going on. But we'll take a look at that. So, oh, God, it's nighttime. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, get, stop. Get, get, get. There you go. Okie dokie. So, a lot of my friends, the month of June, are uploading two videos a day. All two of my friends are. I'm kidding. But, um, both Skips and... Can you not? Both Skips and Slaps are uploading two videos a day. Whether it's because they're on summer vacation already or not, they kind of motivated me to do so. But, you guys really enjoyed Hardcore Dragon Dash? If you guys haven't watched that, I suggest watching it. It was a little fun series. I, don't, I enjoyed it and... Wait, oh yeah, I, I keep on forgetting to point these things out. I also fixed up this thing over here, guys. Oh, God. I also fixed up this thing and made it look kind of nicer as you go down and stuff. Just to make it more appealing to that feather falling for. And I still need to, like, fill in some things. Like, maybe put a block under. But this is, like, the basis of it. I still need to make it, like, a tube going up there. And then make, like, a tunnel leading from the bottom of that to my front door. And then I made this thing here where it's kind of like, oh, yeah, I feel all pretty and stuff. Yeah, as I walk through there. And then I want to build, like, a little stand that the portal can be on that leads down to there. But that was all of our off-camera work, give or take a little bit. Let's crank up our volume a little bit. There you go, 14. So, it seems like you guys did enjoy... Okay, no, no, no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No, no, no. There you go. I want to shoot this gas ball away every time I see it and every time I'm too lazy to move it. There you go. It's gone. 
That makes me so angry every time I see it. I didn't even know I could do that. I just shot it because I was mad. But yeah. You guys seem to really enjoy Hardcore Dragon Dash. So I want to ask you guys, do you guys want to see another short series like that on the channel? If so, okay, that's just a free chest, I guess. Oh, that was the building stuff I left. And I guess somebody had some extra gunpowder, so I'll take it. Oh, Cloud did make his tunnel. Want to go check that out. But okay, yeah, Skips is building. So we'll go check out Cloud's tunnel and then we'll come back to spawn in a bit because I want to get this off. My chest didn't say this now. So, um, let's go to Cloud's house. Let's go check out what he's got going. Because we haven't been to his house in a while, and I'm really curious. Pure andesite. Jeez, Cloud. He did buy five stacks of it off of me for two diamonds. So that's kind of nice of him to give me some diamonds for something as easy to get as andesite. I guess it's just like cobble. So, oh. Praying that wasn't a trap, but okay. Pew, pew. Oh, yeah. So, you guys seem to really enjoy that. So, you guys have any other suggestions? Leave them down below for mini series. And if you guys don't want to see any other miniseries, it's cool, it's fine, I don't really mind. But if you do, let me know, and that can be arranged. Oh, God. Cloud. Cloud's house looks like a XP grinder thingy. But this is how Skate pranked him with buttons. That must have been a pain to clean up. What does it say? Cloud, hope this prank doesn't push your buttons, Skate. Oh, you're so funny, Skate, you're so funny. Oh, God, yeah, Cloud's been really going to work and just messing around. There's a villager in this thing, isn't there? chicken i don't want to break it for it to fly all right let's go to spawn now what am i doing where am i going but if you guys would like me to upload two videos a day it is something i'm considering and wouldn't mind oh oh no cloud said all of his villagers died i forgot but it wouldn't be something that i wouldn't mind doing slaps and skips kind of inspired me and kind of pushed me to do that because hey if they're doing it i thought why not i can do it too and it'll be fun just all three of us just every time because usually it's just us three on the team speak and they'll be like okay gotta go record my second vid and i'll be sitting there like oh okay but this way i can say hey i'm gonna go record my second vid too and we can all go off and do our own thing but hey there's my arrow bye arrow oh no missed oh th there we go okay so say like we can all have that to do and i wouldn't mind as long as you guys are cool with it but the catch with that is would you guys want to see that because i know there are probably plenty of other youtubers whether it's shell members or what are other big groups that people watch? Like Cube members, uh, Minecraft members. Skips is going to get shot by that skeleton, so we're going to save his life. There we go. Nice. So, there's just all that stuff that you guys probably watch, which is kind of difficult for me to say that I'm definitely going to upload two vids a day. Because if you guys are like, fear one vid a day is fine. You don't need to... Okay, wait, by the way, Fashion was selling a pick here with two diamonds. Yeah, he's got to go pick up his diamonds. Come on, Fashion, go pick these up, dude, before someone takes them. This is our ender chest, by the way, looking good with slime blocks. Uh, let's go check our sales. But would two vids a day be something that you got... I swear, whoever's turning all my... Oh, God. Poor cashier. If you guys would want to see two vids a day, and it would be something that you guys wouldn't mind seeing, just let me know. Who did this? I need to like, get a dirt block. Put that there. That's what it's supposed to be like. This way we grab it, go up the ladder, and bam, do that. That's how I get down and up at least. So, hey, drinks on. Hey, hello. Hey, hello. Uh, there's a community in. Here's fashion shop. Let's go buy some food. I am hungry. Jeez. But if two vids a day would be something that you guys would want to see, please let me know down below because I don't know. Like, some of you guys may say, like, hey, the more fear, the better. And some of you guys may be saying, fear, one vid a day is enough for me. I don't need to see any more. So, let me know down below. If you guys do want to see a second video today, leave a two down below in the comment, si comment system. What? In the comment section. And if one vid's fine, leave a one. Oh, Skips. This looks nice, dude. Huh. What is he making? I think he's making a bakery. Yeah. So Skips making a bakery. Adam's making a Wither Skull shop. Uh, this is Cloud's Potion Stop. Still closed. Come on, Cloud. Step it up, man. And then GNH still got his gold shop. He did boost it to 32 gold for a diamond. So I took advantage on that, and he moved it back down to 16. And four gold apples for a diamond. Don't really need gold apples. At least I don't. Slaps did for his villagers, but yeah. Um, And then this is Slaps' iron shop area. But anyway, let me just finish saying this. Jeez, I keep on getting off topic. If you guys want to see two vids a day, let me know. If one vid a day is fine, let me know as well. And if I do do two vids a day, do two. Haha, <laughs> see what I did there? Me neither. If I do do two... Oh my god, I'm losing it. <laughs> If I do do two vids a day, what would you guys want to see? Currently, I'm thinking maybe like daily SG and possibly another random vid a day. But again, it's only if you guys are definitely down for seeing two vids a day. 
because I don't want to pile on extra unnecessary vids if you guys aren't going to enjoy them. Like, for example, currently, I haven't been in this area of spawn in a long time. Jeez, what did we got going on? That's like community chest. This is community. That's been sitting there forever. I'll just take that. Whatever. But, oh, God, I totally just blanked out. The cows are dead. The sheep are pretty much dead. Pigs are gone. Wow, everything's wrecked around this area. That's dead. That was fashion's old, whatever it was. I remember chopping that down for wood, actually. Huh, it's weird. Spawn's coming along really nicely, though, so I'm really proud of that. We I do want to build a second shop, though. If you guys have any shop ideas, leave them down below, because Skate's doing a wool shop. Slaps is doing, like, a silk touch thingy shop. I don't know. Um, I think Slaps is doing, I don't know, maybe a redstone shop I'll do. I don't know if Slaps is doing that. I remember I mentioned it, like, hey, a uh, redstone shop would be a good idea. And so I was like, cool, I might do that. I'm like, oh, okay, okay, whatever, sure. <laughs> kind of disappointed, but if you guys have any shop ideas I can do, leave them down below. It's kind of nice. Um, what else can we do? Let's go back to the house, guys. I do want to show you guys some more things around there. I'll show you guys where the zombie spawner is, actually, because that's something I haven't shown yet. But we got to head back there first. So two visit a day, one visit a day, let me know, and let me know what you would want to see, because also, if I did do two visit a day, it would not start until June 3rd, only because I need to get myself settled. So, again, all suggestions are nice. Okie dokie. In your guys' opinion, how often should pranks be? Because as of now, I'm thinking of waiting a really long time before I prank somebody, because I don't want to over-prank, like, every single day. But Fashion pranked me, Cloud pranked me, Puffy pranked me, and g &H pranked me. I got, like, multi-pranked. I'm getting wrecked right now, guys, by pranks. So, I need to get all these people back, which kind of sucks, but kind of doesn't. Like, it's fun to prank, but just the effort into doing it and not overflowing pranks. I don't, I don't want this to be Shell SMP, where I prank people every single episode. No, it's to be Shell SMP, where I do something SMP-related every episode. I want it to be different. So, if you guys have a suggestion for how often I should prank people, let me know, because that'd be really helpful and handy. Because as of right now, I still need to get Cloud, GNH, and Puffy back. I do have ideas, but I don't want to do them yet because I don't want to overflow pranks. I was thinking maybe every five episodes I can leave a prank episode or something like that. But again, it is... What is that? What is that? Oh, that's a sign from GNH's prank. Oh, man. But if you guys have any suggestions on how often you want to see it, again, greatly appreciated how often pranks should be. And hey, 30 levels. We can chant something on camera now. Sweet. Let's go check out the Chikion farm. Chillin', nice. Aw, I really didn't mean to shoot him. I feel bad now. Just kidding. One piece of chicken for me. Alright, sweet. Let's get out of here. Oh man, I should have fed the sheep, actually. Because I just put in the sheep flooring here. Yeah, it just turned into grass. And I fed two of them. Oh, I fell. Let's get out of here. There we go, route. Alrighty, let's go enchant something on camera, guys. And sorry if you guys think this episode was not productive. It's already 12 a.m., though. And I wanted to get something out for you guys because I thought... You know, after Dragon Dash, for those of you who did not fully enjoy that, thought I could do something else. Um, oh, by the way, I know what I'm going to get by enchanting. I remember checking it, what it was going to be. It's going to be an Unbreaking 3 book. Yeah, right there. Unbreaking 3. Sweet. So, now what I need to decide is, do I want to put Unbreaking 3 on these boots or this chest plate? Because the boots are nice, but the chest plate's nice as well. Ooh. Okay, I need unbreaking on this for sure, and I need unbreaking on this for sure. And I also have all these books that I can fill around with and work with. So I need to decide what I want to do. Like, I can easily put protection 3 and uh, unbreaking 3 on my boots and make those set. But I think I'm going to do the chest plate? Maybe, maybe. Let me, let me see if my next enchant is on a book. Oh my god, this is what sucks. This is why I hate enchanting books sometimes. Okay, respiration, smite, protection. Useless, useless, useless. All right, whatever. Looks like we'll just put it on the chest plate. Bam. There we go. Now we have a nice chest plate. A uh, super defensive one. I don't know when we're going to be fighting the dragon. I know we definitely have some time to spare, but it's always nice just having your god armor set and ready. Just because. Uh, what else can we do with this gear? Let's start combining. Oh, uh, we have feather falling. Okay, we have two feather falling two books, do we? Okay. Do we have more? Feather falling one. Power, power, projectile, pa protection, protection, protection. Okay, we can probably work with the protections and stuff, but you know what we're going to do? We're going to, oh, hello, okay, I love you too, horse, but you don't have to touch. 
let's just enchant a bunch of stuff to finish off this episode. But again, sorry if this is really boring of an episode. I really just wanted to get the potential for two vids out a day. Thank you guys for the Dragon Dash and the support on that. And ask you guys if you want to see any more mini series such as that. But I do want to do some little things that I do need to get accomplished on camera. Like enchanting. Like Protection 1 book, that's nice. Power 2 Protection 1 book. There we go. Knockback 1, Power 2. Eh, we'll take the knockback, whatever. Uh, sharpness or projectile, sharpness for sure, because I don't think we'll ever need projectile, ooh, efficiency or fire, fire aspect's useless, I always go for those and I never use them, efficiency 2, feather falling 3, that's nice, yes, there we go, feather falling 2, I know there was still touch there, but whatever, and alright, sweet, now we can start combining everything, I know we have 2 feather falling there, and we're gonna combine those up, uh, where are they, feather falling 2, feather falling 2, Feather Falling 3, Feather Falling 3 with Feather Falling 3, Feather Falling 4, there we go. So now we have an extra Feather Falling 4 book for our boots or whatever we're going to do with that. Uh, we don't need any sharpness. Do we have another Feather Falling book? Dude, we're stacked on those. Uh, let's take out all of our Protection books. I think that was all of them. Yeah, that was all of them. But we have a lot of efficiency and things like that that we can work with and fiddle around with. But... I guess next episode will just be mining and stuff. Just simple things around the house. Oh, my anvil broke. Ah, fiddlesticks. One, two, three, four of those. Three of these. And let's just make a new one. Whatever. Hopefully people don't use my anvil at my house. That's kind of a bummer. Because these things are really iron consuming to make. 31 iron isn't just something I'd like to throw away. Oh, yeah. We can make protection four now. Sweet. All we need is the levels. Uh, combine those. So five levels and then probably like another seven to combine the other ones. Which is fine. But, again, guys, I really do sincerely apologize for this not being a really into it episode. I just want to really explain some things and get those things off my chest. And explain the new series that are upcoming and all that. And hopefully you guys do understand and do leave your comments and suggestions down below. But I'm probably going to end the episode right about here. Don't know how long this has been, but it's probably been a fairly long time. So, yeah, leave a like if you enjoyed. Be sure to leave your suggestions down below. Oh, no, no, wait, wait. I'll show you guys the zombie spawner. Let's go to that. To the zombie spawner. I don't know, I may make a cut here and there, but probably not. Definitely want to show you guys the spawner, and then we'll cut. But there are just some times... Oh yeah, I made a strip mine here, because this door was really empty, and it was right next to the cow, where I couldn't dig one more block forward. So it can't even be like a room or an extra place to store things, so it had to be a strip mine. I went too far down. But like somewhere through here, there's a zombie spawner. I guess I kind of forgot I dug all the way down. But yeah, there's a zombie spawner like right here. But anyway guys, hopefully you guys didn't mind this. Uh, leave a like if you enjoyed, leave your comments and thoughts down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, again, and I guess I'll see you guys next time.